Hi, we're CNT Auctioneers and welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we're going to be talking a bit about some interesting lots that are coming up in our sale next week. And this is our vintage and collectible toy sale. You can join us live in the room at the Spa Hotel, which is in Tunbridge Wells, or if it suits you better, you can join us at thesaleroom.com. So the sale starts at 10 a.m., uh, but viewing is from 8.30 if you want to come and have a look at all the lots in the flesh in the room. Okay, so the first lot that we are gonna talk about today is lot 170. It is a fine and rare Mark and Gage One uh, Cafe Central. The Cafe Central station is German made, but it's for the French market and it's from 1905. Considering how old it is, it is in a really beautiful condition. So what you would have done if you bought this in 1905, you would take the roof off and there's a little place that you can put a candle. You would light the candle, you put the roof back on. The whole idea, if I put it back on, would be that the smoke would come out of the chimney and it would light up all of these very beautiful windows as if it was glowing from the inside. So the estimate for this lovely piece is 3,000 to 5,000 pounds. Yeah, come on down to the room or bid online. The next look that's very interesting that we're talking about that's being offered next week is this lovely chap here, Adam the Porter. He's made by Layman EPL 689, circa 1920. It is lot 292 going to be on offer on Tuesday. Eamon is a German maker. He's still in a really good working condition. There's a couple of rubs uh, of paint where they've come off, but other than that, in good nick. Adam's mechanism is still working, and if we turn the fixed key, like so, as you can see, there he goes, his legs are moving. The estimate for Adam the Porter is three to five hundred pounds. This is lot 321, which is a rare Louis Marx toy from the USA. It is a Rex Mars tin plate target game. It's from the 1950s. These little silver ships, they are incredibly rare. Um, these were salesman samples. And it is estimated at 300 to 500 pounds. We have a large selection of die-cast toys coming up on Tuesday the 17th, which includes Corgi and Dinky. And if you've been waiting for part two of the Silver Collection, that's on its way to you on 17th of September. So, so TV and film related die-cast toys are always really popular and we've got two really lovely items coming up on Tuesday to show you. First one is this one. It's 463 and it is the James Bond Aston Martin DB5 first edition silver one. So it is really lovely and it is in great condition. It's in the rarer bubble uh, box and it comes with its instructions. They're all there and the badge. And Just to show you the back of the box as well that has uh, obviously the James Bond print on it. The estimate for this lovely piece is 300 to 500 pounds. So another nice example of TV and film related die-cast toys is this very nice Corgi Batmobile and Batboat uh, gift set. The box, as you can see, is still in a very good condition and this is from the 1970s. This is gift set three. Um, this actual one never came with instructions but it's still got the missile on the sprue. The estimate on this Batmobile and Batboat is 150 to 250 pounds. Thank you for watching our video which is about showcasing some of the interesting lots that are coming up on Tuesday the 17th of September. If you want to see more of the lots coming up on Tuesday the 17th of September, you can go to our website www.cntauctions.co.uk and the catalogue is live online. Don't forget to like and subscribe and keep your eye out for more of these videos that will be coming before all of our sales to showcase some interesting items.